Hello everyone! My name is Mike Rajeda and welcome to my channel. And today, we'll be tasting weird flavored snacks from here in New Zealand. Slightly odd kind of flavors. Um, here in New Zealand, there are a few things that came out this week that I would like to try. To start this off, we got Stag Ball. There we go. Stag Ball. Bluebird. Okay. Bluebird is, if not the most famous brand of chips here in New Zealand. And they just came out with this flavor of chips. And if you ask me, hmm, spaghetti flavored chips. How, uh, how could you go wrong with that, right? So, let's go taste it. Surprisingly, I kind of like him. It has that very, very mild flavor of spaghetti. Even they smell, it even smells like spaghetti, sort of. Weirdly enough, I think it's good. It does taste like spaghetti, I swear. For a very, very, very light flavor of it. Kind of smells like it too. Kind of reminds me of the chips in the Philippines that we had. It's called Picnic and it was ketchup flavor. So that's quite weird. Ketchup flavor, spaghetti, I guess it's called tomato sauce. It's quite good really. It's quite odd that you can actually kind of smell even the ground beef. When you cook spaghetti, and in this case spaghetti bolognese, you can kind of smell the ground beef in the spaghetti sauce. So I'd say it's a good, it's pretty good. And if you remember, um, I rate the foods here in my channel from 1 to 5. 5 being the best food you ever tasted, you have to get out there and get it and taste it for yourself. Four is being good, three being average, two being bad, and number one being, ah, uh, stay away from that food. So, Bluebird's uh, spaghetti bowl uh, chips, I think I would give it a four. It's quite good, really. I, I have some more, please. Up next, we have another flavor from Bluebird. It's chicken flavor. Um, for some other countries like New Zealand and the Philippines, chicken flavor isn't that uncommon for chips. But in other countries, this is quite weird. So I decided just to add it into our taste test anyway. Mmm. That's pretty good. <laughs> I would describe the taste. It's like if you buy those um, cup noodles that are flavored chicken, and instead of um, making it into soup, you sprinkle the seasoning into the ch uh, into chips, and this is what you get: chicken flavored chips. Really, kind of smells like chicken. Or maybe a little bit of like egg. It's weird, but I like it. All right, it's time to rate these chips, and I think I would give it four. Yeah, it's good. Uh, I wouldn't say rush to the grocery store and buy some of these, and, but it's definitely something I would eat again and again. Next up is drink. We got here. Peach, no sugar Coca Cola. Ah, peach. It even has a peach colored top. Okay, it smells like regular Coke. Very good. I mean, it tastes like Coke, but with not even a subtle taste of peach. 
it's very peachy. Peachy in a very artificial kind of way. But yeah, it's pretty good. I don't mind it. If I have to rate this one, I would say a 3. Pretty average. I mean, it's not... It's not bad, but it's quite artificial flavor. So, I would... Mm, I'm in between a 2 and a 3 here, so maybe 2.5. Not bad bad but not okay enough because it's too artificial flavored for me all right next up is we got um an item from mcdonald's macas others be call people call it that way it's raspberry and custard pie hmm. smells like the usual stuff Air country. Mm, interesting. This is actually very surprisingly good. The raspberry cream. I was expecting it to be like a raspberry jam. It's actually more like raspberry cream. And it's mostly like custard as well so it's very creamy not too sweet and the flavor is there mm. maybe if I would rate this food I would give it a five you better get out to Macas and try this out it's good it's it's different from other things that I've tasted before. Raspberry isn't too sweet. Like I said, it wasn't like a jam. It's more of a custard dough. And it's very, very, very good. So you better get out there and try this out. So those are the four foods that we reviewed for today. And comment down below. Let me know if there are other um, weird flavored foods that you think would be appropriate to review in this channel. And if you like the channel, say, click the thumbs up. If you didn't like it, click the thumbs down. Subscribe, share, and see you next time.